Hi guys! Wow, it's been a really, really, really long time since I filmed a vlog. But anyways, um, today's gonna be the day that changes that. I, if you're new, I am Samantha Campbell and this is Simplicity Vlog where we keep it simple and classy every single day. And I've been kind of absent. I mean, last time I vlogged was I was back in California. Now I am back in school. I have been here for exactly a week, and that means I am in Oregon currently, and it's kind of been a little bit of a crazy hot mess, if you know what I mean. I am taking 18 credits, so it's just been a lot of juggling, um, social life, and eating, and school. Like, that's been my life, and sleeping. Not really sleeping, because it's college, but um, that's that's been my week, and... Um, so today, I wanted to share with you a couple of things that are either new to me or going to be new to me. And so we're going to experience some new things together. Um, and if you're interested, you can go out and try them yourself. So first thing being, um, my hair, I donated my hair last summer. And this year, it's like growing out. And I cut it three times since last summer just to make sure that it's looking okay, like layered wise and dead ends are in check. But um, it's grown a lot this summer. And let me tell you, if you have a, go a Costco card, you need to, you need to invest in this because they're delicious and they work. So um, I'm not a sponsor or they're not a sponsor of me. So I'm just doing this because I do believe in them. So this is it. Um, Nature's Bounty, and these are bio biotin gummies, and they taste like little strawberry gumdrops, and they're delicious, and they have really helped my hair. Um, my hair has been kind of damaged. Um, I had to stop with the hydrogen peroxide because I think I was doing it a little too long and a little too frequent, that my hair was actually starting to suffer from it, so if you've watched my hydrogen peroxide video, um, which was what, taken like half a year ago. Um, be careful. Um, I think I was getting a little carried away with it. So just a warning to anybody who is also getting a little too carried away with from it. It will damage your hair. I, I think I stressed that in the video. But um, I don't want any of you to go bald or to have fried hair. So um, protect against that. Be very, very, very cautious when working with that product because... Hydrogen peroxide is a chemical, and it can be used to damage and will make your hair fall out <laughs> if you put it in for too long. Um, so this has really helped out. Um, if you have a Costco card, once again, it is at Costco, and they it's big. Um, these have 230 gummies total, and I take two a day. So... And I've only been taking this for about a month and a half and my hair has already grown like an inch since then. And that's really good. And my hair is really soft <laughs> from it. So try that. Um, second thing being, we're moving into food now. Um, so that was vitamins. This is food. I watched, shout out to Graveyard Girl. I'll probably tag her in this video, but... I love her. I love you, Bunny. You're amazing. But I watched her Lay's um, potato chip eating like vlog, and I wanted to try them out myself. I am allergic to pork, more specifically pork grease. So I can't eat any like breakfast items because a lot of them contain like bacon and like all that stuff. But I can't eat eggs. Um, my, I recently became allergic to this, so I grew up loving biscuits and gravy for my <laughs> breakfast thing, but unfortunately, I like country gravy, and most country gravies that I know and that I actually love contain pork in it, or bacon, or any sort of that, so I can't eat them anymore. Luckily, Lace has come out with their new, um... You know, like, how they have the fan submit, like, what they want. I don't know if you guys have seen this. This has been out for a couple, maybe a month, or a couple weeks. Um, they have Southern Biscuits and, yeah, Biscuits and Gravy, and I am 
super excited. As you can see, I haven't opened up the bag um, because I've been waiting to make this video, but I have been waiting several weeks in order to find this. They've been sold out at multiple Walmarts and Targets that I've seen, so they must be good because they're always sold out of this specific flavor. Unfortunately, I did not get the Reuben or the, I don't know how to say it, G-Y-R-O. Um, I'm not even going to try to say it, but it's that Greek stuff, and I they, they didn't look appealing to me, so I didn't want to try them. Um, if you want, you can go out and find them. They're always stocked on the shelf, so they're probably not that good. I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna go off of that. Um, I did, however, buy West Coast truffle fries because I am a Californian and I go to Umami Burger, which is known for their truffle fries, and I love them. So I bought this. They do taste like truffle fries. They have a lot of um cheese flavor like if you took sour cream and onion and I think Bunny talked about this um if you take a lot of sour cream and onion flavor and then you like kind of drizzle a little bit of truffle oil and a lot of like parmesan kind of cheese to it flavor that would be this chip like I don't know exactly how to describe it I don't know why it kind of tastes like sour cream and onion but it does and I wish it kind of didn't because when I eat truffle fries, it doesn't really taste like sour cream and onion, so I don't know what they were getting off of that. But it, they do taste good, I will say that. But they do taste a lot like sour cream and onion, just with cheese on top. So, there's that. Um, me speaking from being a Californian, that's that's my take on it. Um, so, right now, I'm going to try these and share them, what I think with them. Hopefully they're not terrible, because... I will be really sad because then I can't eat biscuits and gravy ever. So we're just going to try this. They smell interesting. Like, I don't know. Recently I had um, rosemary and olive oil chips, um, like, last week. And they weren't Lay's, but... They kind of smell like that, like how the rosemary olive oil ones smelled, and I don't know why these ones smell like it, because when I think biscuits and gravy, I don't think of rosemary and such, but maybe they taste better than they smell. Um, I know for a fact, the truffle oil ones do not smell good in the bag. They don't smell great, but they taste great. So let's just try these and see what I think. Now, they smell like rosemary and potato chip. I don't know. Okay. So, there's a lot of potato chip flavor coming through. Which is kind of throwing me off a little bit. Um, but they're really good. Um, I wouldn't necessarily, if you blindfolded me and had me taste these, I wouldn't have associated them with biscuits and gravy. Um, but now that I know, they kind of taste like biscuits and gravy. More the gravy than the biscuits. Um, but yeah, they are pretty good. Um, I can see myself snacking on these at midnight. So... Now you know. Now I know. And we're all happy. So, I will say, bravo Lay's. Like, even though these aren't 100% like the flavor probably you were going for, but they're both really good. And I can see myself snacking. And that's always a good sign. So, two thumbs up for delicious flavor. I will say that. Okay. Third thing we're going to go into is furniture. Um, now, I don't know how many of you love Walmart. I adore Walmart. Um, I probably talk about it like in all my videos. Probably not, but I feel like I do. Um, I go there probably every weekend. And in those times, I walk around every aisle, even if I'm not Looking for a specific thing, I probably travel in every single department just to see, like, what I could possibly use or see myself using. 
and see what like else is new. So I went last week with my madre and I noticed that all the dorm back to school stuff was out. So me being a college student, I'm like, ha, huh, let's see what kind of deals we can get. Now you can't see it because we're in this corner, but my room is significantly smaller this year than it was last year. So we've had to deal with a lot of organizing and trying to cram things into like little spaces as much as possible. Now, and that's when these things came into play. So I'm just going to get up. I'm currently filming on my iPhone, so that's why I'm having to move it. Um, hopefully you can see this. Hold on. We're going to go down here. So this thing right here. I don't know if you can see it. It's an ottoman. And it originally came to me flat and folded. And it pops up to be this thing and a lot of people have sat on this and they're it's really soft it's made out of suede and um it's really comfortable it's padded on the top and the top is the most sturdy out of all of it which i would hope it would be but um the rest of it folds into place and it's been keeping a lot of things and it the lid comes up and then you can store stuff inside of it. So this, I have three of these and they come in different colors and different patterns and different fabrics. And so you can like mix and match and whatever you want. And I shove them under my bed. Um, so that's been a little handy dandy when I'm needing to store a couple items and get rid of excess room. <laughs> or to provide excess room for when I have guests. And they provide excellent seating, so my friends have places to sit their batoms on. Okay, fourth being my outfit, and I'm gonna probably do this in a way that you can probably see it. So, top level, I don't know if you can see it, you can see my iPhone, hey, hey, hey. Um, is, I don't know if you can see me. Okay, we'll just go like that because that's the easiest way. So here's my scarf. Um, I have just a regular black infinity scarf, which I got from Walmart. Green top, tank top, high neck. I also got at Walmart. Um, and then we're gonna move down to bottoms. So I currently have sunflower printed leggings, which ironically enough, I got at Walgreens for only like three dollars and they're really soft I don't know what kind of material they're made out of but I love it <laughs> and then shoes I don't know if you can see them I have a picture on my Instagram so if you want a better picture you can get it there I have little ankle combat boots that also have like a little bit of knit on the sides to make it look like I'm wearing socks but I'm yeah I'm it's part of the shoe and I got these at Walmart for $25. So if you can't tell that I love Walmart, I do love Walmart. And I spend probably a majority of my time shopping at Walmart. Um, so that has been my vlog. Welcome back to school if you are a student like me. If you're not, then hopefully you, or maybe you have a child and maybe you had fun shopping for their back to school stuff. If you don't have a child and you're not a student, I recommend eating the chips. If you're a healthy person, I'm sorry, but the chips are really good. So splurge a little bit. I'm all about that cheat day. Oh, you can see myself in the mirror. Um, but yes, um, Ottomans are great. I wouldn't even just use them for college. I would suggest them to my sister who lives in Denver and she can use them at her house. So yes, use them. If you like my outfit, I told you where I bought everything and everything's comfortable. It's raining already outside and we're experiencing a little bit of a storm. So it's been kind of nice to break out my fall attire early, but I like the sunflowers because they kind of give it a summer look. So hopefully you liked my video. I liked making it. Um, thank you for testing out the chips with me. <laughs> I was really scared I wasn't going to like them, so I'm really glad that I did. So anyways, um, hopefully I'll make another video very, very soon because I miss you guys. So 
that'll happen soon. Yay! Um, I'll talk to you when I have time, okay? Love you all. Have a good one. Bye. <laughs>